Hello everyone, I want to share the storyline for the episode that aired last night. In this episode, articles about Sehyun's testimony were spread. The articles claimed that Yuri deliberately created a scandal to take the role of Yeon played by Yeon Song. It was also mentioned in the article that the audition was conducted fairly and Yeon Song truly deserved the role based on her own merits. This article had a significant impact overnight, changing people's perception of Yeon Song. Everyone turned to support her and criticized Yuri. As a result of the article, Juri and Sehun were fired from the Hidden Memory film. Their careers in the acting industry came to an end. They will never be able to return to the world of acting. Meanwhile, Hyung and Sunwoo are considering bringing an song back into the Hidden Memory film. Mr. Kim even asked Sunwoo to persuade an song. However, Eun Sunwoo feels that it will be difficult to convince Eun Song because she has already made up her mind not to return to the villa. Despite this, Mr. Kim encouraged Sunwoo to keep trying, emphasizing that Eun Song should focus on the movie and her dreams rather than their personal relationship. When Sunwoo met Eun Song, she noticed that Eun Song became increasingly cold towards him. Eun Song still refuses to return to Hidden Memory Villa believing that she cannot fully focus on her role if Sunwoo is involved. She asked Sunwoo not to contact her regarding the film again. They both part ways and shed tears. Eunsung believed that this is the only way to protect her parents. Hyung also informed Eunsung that Sihun and Juri were removed from Hidden Memory Villa and conveyed their apologies to her. Additionally, Hyung sincerely apologized to Eunsung for her past behavior that caused her suffering while working on Chang Film. Hyung also revealed that she has given up on Sunwoo forever, and now they are starting new lives separately. After meeting Eun Song, Hyung also met Eun Hyuk and expressed her gratitude towards him for gradually changing her. Eun Hyuk, who always believed that Hyung is a kind and warm-hearted woman, inspired her to become a better person. Their story is about to begin. And he couldn't love another woman besides Hyung, as he even refused to go on a blind date because his heart belongs only to her. Towards the end of this episode, Anha received a phone call from Jung A, which she reluctantly answered. Anha is still angry at Jung A for revealing Dong Gu and Chun Young's affair to An Song. While they were talking on the phone, Chun Young overheard their conversation and immediately went to Jung A's house, slapping her. Chun Young accused Jung Ae of not changing at all in the past 30 years and she only believes what she wants to believe without knowing the truth. Okay everyone, that is the storyline for this time and thank you for watching my video.